what's up explorers so we're gonna head into a little house it's a small little bungalow but I've heard that everything's completely left um, it's completely abandoned everything is completely left in this place and I'm excited to get in there you know me I love exploring abandoned places with I don't know just with a bit of a character to them really you like the other um, stuff, don't I've heard it's a little bit damaged but we're still gonna go and check it out anyway so let's get inside let's go you ready to do it just there and there's someone in the garden so yeah we're gonna get inside we'll come out and do the outside in a minute let's go let's do this take me inside this is the first room if you'd like to have a look at it check it out see if it's sufficient for you so it's a small little house guys but very 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 dated so Stop many really old work. things in here Loving the older kind of 70s style fireplace, and then they went for a bit of modern fake brick wallpaper. <laughs> Surprise, it's not real fake. Wallpaper. The Zender piano, these are before I've seen these before, but oh, it is a lamp. Yeah. Did they start their life as a lamp, or has someone converted it over the years? But yeah, imagine that being all polished up in brass, how shiny that would be. Little sharp TV. That's like a pendulum or something from a clock. The old beddings and sheets and stuff, bro. <laughs> a water tank. <laughs> That'd have been ripped out. Some we could people. use it as a moonshine steel. <laughs> moonshine steel. And there you can see, as I said, an elderly couple or an elderly person is all these shoes there. His little Zimmer frame. Okay. Look at his jackets there, bro. Is it? A little tiny elephant. Oh yeah. Trying <laughs> these as well. A little steak and kidney puddings. Very old. It's still in there as well. August 2009. Do you want to eat it? <laughs> Say hello to Bob. This is Bob. <laughs> Bob and his dog. Bob and dog. <laughs> look at the air dryer. Wow, look at that. Curries. Deluxe. Things had so much style, didn't they? So back in the day. Here's a little temperature gauge there. Roger, send the uh, Curry's Deluxe. I've got one in my home. Yeah? For my hair, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got some like, letters and stuff, but look at the mould in there. Are you going to open yeah. that up? So it's, this is definitely so, so old. Loving these old stalls. Stuff like this, I just... It's a shame because I worry about places like this that it's so open, honestly, everywhere we could literally get into anywhere this place. It's so, so open. Lovely little brushes here. <laughs> little sweet brush. And straight into another room. So it's a small little place, but look at this. Imagine there's a piano in it. This reminds me of no Evil Dead. Condor. When they wake the dead. Don't forget the neighbours. Yeah. 
Look at this. Rush. Rushworth and Draper, Liverpool. Mm. Might have been violent, yeah, it's a very musical family we're getting that was here. Well, the guy was very musical. Right, well, it's got a piano there and a piano there. Yeah, it's really bizarre the layout of this place. Oh, that granddad's little granddad's cottage. This is really weird as well. He's got like his little shed rack inside the house. Something you'd see outside. Did you spot the caravan at the front, Rod? Yeah, I did. Oh, by the way, this is Rod. Check him out. Exploring the Rod Instagram. Check him out. All these white shirts. And that's some of the old clothes and stuff. Been abandoned a long time, isn't it? Definitely, yeah. As you can see, that just on the keys and that how, how this place is really, really abandoned. With a violin case, as we said. Is there a make on that? No. I love these as well, like the, ha the old houses with the old pitcher rails, and the way they hang like everything off of them. I love the old rooms are real, that's what I was about. Yeah, so do you ever seen the old film Evil Dead? Yeah. You know, they find the old cassette player and it's like that. Condor. Wow. So many things. What is this? No idea what that was for. It's like something's man made. He's made it something. Got a little doll's ass bath. Good luck, we need that. Oh, look at his little jacket. And the hat's hanging up. Cool, isn't it? We'll have a glass of Baileys. <laughs> Baileys? What are these? Oh, they're, um, what you stick. Oh, look at that. Is that a heater? Yeah, hot point. I'll hide that out. Right, so we just hide the letter up, we turn it over. Look at the old heater. And we just looked at his letter as well. The guy that lived here was called Ernest. So, yeah, Grandad Ernest. So we're going to head through to one of the bedrooms. Wow. No way would you trust that above your head. Look how it's sitting. Yeah, look. No way. Guys, put in a link below, would you want to sleep with that above your head? No problem. Wow, and here Teddy. Look how old he is, bro. This would be refurbed again, he's so old. You can see in there, look, all the old clips. Very, very old bear. Can't see a maker on him. I kind of want to cover him up, <laughs> poor little thing. Yeah, look at this. I mean, these are what you put shelves up with. Yeah, yeah you've got a commode. Not really seeing here. A little cupboard. Like right, sorry, bro. Go on. What was you showing me? I like the Give me a little... Well, show show me some the, stuff, bro. There's the other caravan. Is it out there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, look. There's a little blue caravan out there. There's little books. Again, little tea bag cards. Water changes. Yeah, the iron is so, so cool. Yeah. Don't even know what that is in there. Oh, look at it. Yeah. This just looks like maybe her jacket here. It's a woman's That's jacket, I believe. Oh, like yeah, this. we had these. I had the jumper like that. <laughs> it just proves to you how cold it would have been in here for him. And there's one pillow, so it makes me think that he was here on his own and after a while. Single glazing, you know, don't, don't yeah. stop no cold. cold I mean, it's cold. Day. It's cold in here now, and it's sunny outside. It's actually warmer outside. Yeah, I've got a winter coat. Do you think on it's warmer in here outside than it is in here? Yeah, I've got a winter coat on, and I'm, I'm frozen. A little tiny wardrobe. There you've got the tea holders. A bit oh, Mark, do you remember these? The old McDonald's toys. Oh, yeah. You wind them <laughs> that's up when they were, Yeah, that's when they were proper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's cool. And this has got all about them sort of This toys. is probably 19, yeah, 1986. That's going to say, it's probably 90s. And look, I have stuff well made as well. The old drawers. You can't beat them, is that anyway? The Hoover. 
Again, I've said this in videos before. Sorry, Dave, I'm not hoovering in here. We're quite lazy, a lot of English people, where we... Not lazy, but we we stick to names, like the brand Hoover. Like, oh, can you do the hoovering? Do you know what I mean? But it could be any Hoover, we just call it a, a, a vacuum cleaner, we just call it a Hoover. Is he stuck everywhere, don't want to stuck you. Yeah, yeah. 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 butter scotch. Look how size them jars. You can get them there. No. Everything's too small, they shrink everything. 1.5 kilos. That's a lot. I have that wall drive, bro. Let's have a little look. See if we can see anything in there. No. Is there a make on that? Don't want to let the neighbours know we're here. No. Just can't get over that bed. Mm -hmm. You'd sleep with that heater on like that. Things weren't about stuff like no. that they did though back in the day. Absolutely, see all the plasters coming off, the damp setting in. But to be honest, a lot of this may have been like this, but we ain't found nothing for like only 90s, I think. No, what was the date like that? They're just coming back into the living room area. I love There's little things like this as well. I love the old light switches. I've been here before, my name's on them, you know. Is that in there? Oh. Yeah. The old curtains, again, it's just probably just keep the heat in. Do you know, shut rooms off. No, it's a sliding door, babe. Oh, is it? It's a slide, isn't it? I'm glad the fridge is already open. So I don't get stuff like this. I don't know why people just come here. Yeah, that is really old pad of customers. Like, people come here and they've trashed, like, broke windows out and that. Why? It's, it's pathetic, it really is. Yeah, people need to stop doing it. Though. You can see that like, nothing has been used here for a long time. I don't get why there's taps there and two taps there. What was that about? I would like to make out I know what I'm going to talk about, but I don't think. Bro, look how old these kettles are, like the, uh, the dents and stuff. Uh, saucepans, sorry. Kettle. That's what it's saying out there, guys. There's an old blue caravan out there in that garage, by the looks of it. Oh, there's receipts here. This could kind of give a date. Shopping list. Value tarts. Custard creams. It's a bit of you, Mark. There's no... See the date on there, bro? Yeah, look, like 2000, 26th of the 9th. So it's been a good 20 years. Yeah, and these are all like go back in like date format because this one here is uh, July 2000. Yeah. So this this is the latest receipts here, and he's collected all these that you go back again to another one. Another one. Definitely. Isn't that mug? <laughs> What's that? It's oh, that's literally right here. Here you got the cooker. What can anyone say that's been in here, to be honest? Like, hey, that? what that's can anyone say, Rod? What can anyone say if we get caught in here? It's yeah. completely wide open, isn't it? Yeah, and just walk straight in. What's that old machine there? Oh, it's a mangle. Yeah. Rinse, rinse and close There's an old mangle That's in the garden. Say, <laughs> just put a light under it. Got a fan. We, so we've come to this cottage today and we just met one of our fans. Did you get it? <laughs> Look at these scales. And they still work. How cool is that? Your little mixing, uh, your little scales there. Put your little measurements in. Yeah, we see one of these, yeah. Belling. Oh, yeah. It's just yeah. quite a yeah. common Same. appliance, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's got the hot pot. Yeah. Mark, I feel like I'm going to drift with this. A drip. Oh, I've oh, oh, just ruined it. I'll yeah, just sit here. No, piece on your bomb no, no, but to be fair, you have to correct me sometimes. I'll just look at stuff. I'll get told off all the time because do I don't read stuff like properly. Even more on camera <laughs> if I don't correct you. <laughs> but, but at least if I correct you, you correct yourself. <laughs> Look at these baths were back in the day, man. You see what elderly people would struggle getting out of that, not being like horrible, rude to say that to elderly people. Yeah, yeah. plungers. That is his denture bit. Denture mould. I love his little cupboards. I'd love to like take one of these little cupboards and like restore it. Yeah, people use them for all Yeah. Stuff, Obviously, we're not going to take it. I'm just saying I'd love to take it. Check with him as well. Yeah, old... there's really things right there. Uh, his dressing gown. 
it to anyone. You remember when they were up there? Yeah, I love the old systems though. Yeah, all the time. And everything was done so well, like all around the light fittings is all like a, like a Paul Slim glass. Um, it's not Paul Slim, what is it called? I think it's Paul Slim. No, there's another name for it. What is this stuff guys? I'm sure it's like a Paul Slim, but I could be wrong. It, no, I swear there's another name for it. I can't remember. Right. So we're going to have a little... We're going to have a little argument over the light fittings. But there's another name for something like that. Isn't it? Ceramic. Ah, it is ceramic, I think. Ceramic. Yeah, I think it's right. Is there another name? Ceramic. Okay, no, I'm pretty certain he's right. It's ceramic. Is there another name? Um, I'm not sure. Mm, maybe it's just. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling a bit cold here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's cool. Dull chaps, really. Oh, look at that. I've got that. Oh, this is a nice one, babe. What is that? So this is rod. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out, bro. That's sharp. Yeah, don't. And it's that. compact. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Another thing that I don't want to miss here. Look at the old, like style wallpapers. And in here, what is that? I don't imagine anyone would have wallpaper like that now, really. Oh God! Hey, fancy bringing your spog in here. <laughs> <laughs> Are we punging all this, Mark? Are we doing puns? <laughs> it's puns, isn't it? Sorry, that. <laughs> I'm just trying to balloon stuff now. <laughs> I didn't know the guy was Danish. It's not, um, it's just the bungalow, isn't it? Yeah, it's just it. It's, it's just the bungalow. Like yeah, I think we'll just give you a cool, cool little tour around. I don't know what they are. Happy 90th birthday, didn't see that to granddad. That's horrible. Sorry I can't be there to drink this with you. Lots of love, James. There you go. So it is Grandad's cottage. It's an old Horlix car. Yeah, yeah. The old Horlix. But yeah, it's so cool. Vocal Yorks. Work, works. What is wrong with me? I can honestly run and look at stuff and I just say completely different. That's a goblin pie. I wonder if that's still Yeah, yeah we're that. saying that's it's not edible. It's a little tiny elephant. <laughs> we're getting a date on this place 20 years. <laughs> the last, all these receipts are in the cupboard. Go right back, and it's the newest one, 2000, year 2000. 20, September, years. the one behind it was July 2000, and then it all goes back, so it looks like we're getting a date of 21 years, and when you look around, you kind of get that. I it's love these. Quite retro, like they? art, sort of deco, yeah, 70s, and the old frosted moon glass. Yeah. Right, we're going to head out of here, guys, we're going to check out the oh, outside. Nice. See what's He's even got an outdoor fire. Just joking, guys. Look at the old wooden boat. Take to the lake. Let's go. Sail me off, honey. Oh, cool. oh yeah. Old rusty wrench. Color gas. This is for the old gas pipes. Switch probably gas mains off. Love this. The way nature's just taking the window. The old boat. Sail away with me, honey. Not a bad little location. That's a cool little house. But probably not the house. That we do. Uh, it's it's quite actually it's quite. A, I mean, look at the size of it. It's tiny, but when you're in there, it's actually bigger than what it looks. I think. So our little our man Rodney is a bungalow man. I so you felt at home in there, bro. <laughs> Obviously it's in better condition, that one. No, I'm your one man, I do. <laughs> oh, cool. Yo, what's that? 20? 20? It's an old sewing machine stand. Yeah, they put a sewing machine on top. Look at the old cot. Oh, yeah. Old baby's cot. Yeah, Mark, you're having a baby soon, bro. Love the smell in it. That old, that old shed smell. There's old Elton John when he's uh, very young. So these are 2000 as well. So everything's 2000. There's some like religious things there awake, obviously. Jesus, oh your brain does it, how does it work? So okay, these are like little magazines I'm guessing on 
like probably what you used to collect years ago, um, like your Reader's Digest kind of like things that you'd collect. I love the old vase. Ros Alex, I have no idea what that is. Before work, rub well into hands. After work, wash it. Oh, okay. So is it like a protector or something? Like a barrier green? I do love the old bike. I'm sure they ain't got the old dynamo system on it. Look at the old shopping little rack on the back. That is definitely an old speaker. I love the old call cable and all used to do. That's so cool. That's, was that built into caravan during the one? There's an old bike rusting into the ground. What, around the back? Yeah, bro. Oh, look at this. I didn't want to step in here, but... These are really old, so does anyone want to give a date on these? I would say 60s, 70s. But again, look at the old gas lamps, and you think these are inside. These days. So all, all the lamps in it would be gas powered. No way, is that still in the box? Is that an actual Philips radio still in the box? Ah, it's empty. I'd have had to get it out just to look at that. Yeah, that'd be nice. Look at these. I love these old. Look at the toilet as well. well it would have been like an old toilet, maybe, at one point. Yeah, it would have been. It's so cool. Man, this is cool. I, do you know what? I'd love to renovate one of these old style car yeah, yeah. I like the old American Airstream ones. Yeah, beautiful. I like they kept, uh, I think they were the old milk bottle tops. Do you remember that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. you got Music Masters, Caesar Lands, like books and stuff just deteriorating. And again, here, look. And we were saying a minute ago about Reader's Digest. Yeah. That's cool. That's a uh, bedpan, isn't it? Yeah, that's an old old bike, that is. Where? Oh, wow, yeah. There's an engine block there. That's a, there's a four cylinder engine block. Anyone know what that is? You recognise what engine that would be? Four cylinder. Look at the cams on it. Camshaft completely solid. Anyone want a project? <laughs> what make is that? Hudson. That'd be worth money, I reckon. Probably one of their spokes completely disintegrated. Here. Yeah, see the badge part is still there. The lawnmower. Everything's still there. Yeah. I think we're done here anyway. It's a cool little house. Yeah, it's a cool new location. And uh like we say, we've got to show all the good and the bad. Well this is an old um you know the old amplifier of it. Yeah. Old bike. There's an old push bike here. Makes you wonder what's buried under there. Could be some little hidden treasures still sitting in there. Shame, really. No one's here to take. I don't know why it's not preserved or nothing's done with it. It's really old. Never seen a small one like that. Little, well, that's one of the feet of it, it Little desktop suction. Yeah, it might be a bit easy to this way. Now you like mang mangle your pants. And there you go. What's up, explorers? So, hopefully, you enjoyed Grandad's Cottage. Um, as I said, it was a little bit trash, but you know what? I was still so excited to see it. So many original things in there. Like, and it's mad to think 21 years that's been abandoned. Ernest, do you know, all my love to you, and obviously, just out of respect that we obviously did visit the place. We even said when we left, like, thanks for letting us come into your place in case there is a spirit and everyone watching us. Like, but yeah. Love to all the family and uh, it's a shame really that people go in there and think it's okay to trash things. If you see this video and you find this place, you know where it is, go in, respect it. But if it's sealed 
at the moment it's completely open I shouldn't say that but it is uh, we walk straight in but if it is sealed leave it sealed let these places stay but anyway love to you all that from me that from Mark that from, from Rod check him out exploring Rod Instagram link is in description as I said we are on Facebook Instagram Twitter Snapchat you name it we're on it love to you all stay safe and that from me Mark and Rod love you loads hello explorers so Thank you so much for watching another one of my videos. So after finding out a little bit more from the neighbors, they said that the couple lived here their entire life. She sadly passed away at 89, where he made it all the way to 90. But then they also said after he, she passed away, it was within a few months he hit his 90th birthday. And then a few days after they found him asleep, looking out of his favorite window, passed away. They also said this was a very musical family. So the years they lived here, there was always piano music and stuff coming in from the windows. And after she passed, it was a silent house. Until this day as well now, it still sits silent. Love you all guys. Stay safe. God bless. See you soon on the next adventure.